LabConco's Triad Freeze Dry System is an all-in-one freeze dryer that allows pre-freezing, primary drying, and secondary drying in one unit. This video will show you how to program the Triad in automatic mode. The Triad is equipped with a microprocessor control that allows up to five programs with six different segments. The five programs, once programmed, will be retained in memory. Now we will program a sample program. Press the display button until the auto indicator is lit. The P in the display will flash and the program number that will be run is shown. To select different programs, press the up or down button to change program number, programs 1 through 5. When the desired program number is displayed, press enter. The display will show the parameters that were last entered for this program. Push the enter button until SEG is blinking. Use the up or down button to get to pre-freeze. In this segment, the shelves automatically cool to max cold or minus 75 degrees. Press enter and set the time to 12 hours. Press enter again to store the parameter and advance the cursor until SEG is blinking. Use the up button to get to SEG 1. This is the primary drying step. The shelf temperature should be slightly colder than the eutectic temperature of the sample. Push enter again until ramp is blinking and enter 1.5 degrees per minute. Push enter. Push enter again until time is blinking and set the time to 24 hours. Press enter to store the parameters and advance the cursor until SEG is blinking. Use the up button to get to SEG2. You are now in the secondary dry cycle and will add heat to the shelves to drive off any residual moisture. Push enter again until ramp is blinking and enter 1.5 degrees per minute. Push enter until temp is blinking and use the up button to set the temperature to 15 degrees C. Push enter again until time is blinking and set the time to 12 hours. Press enter to store the parameters and advance the cursor until SEG is blinking. For SEG 3, 4, and 5, we will set the time to zero. If any of the parameters are changed, the Enter button must be pressed for the new value to be stored. If Enter is not pressed within 10 seconds after the last parameter adjustment, the value will return to the previously stored value. To monitor the system during operation, press the Display button to obtain the monitor screen. The display will show the collector temperature, shelf temperature, system vacuum, and sample temperatures. After the freeze-dry process is complete, the samples can be stoppered under vacuum or nitrogen. To stopper under vacuum, simply move the stoppering control toward the lower position. To backfill the chamber with a gas, connect a cylinder of the desired gas to the backfill port. Allow the vacuum pump to run for a few minutes while the gas enters to permit the backfill gas to surround the freeze-dried sample. When the vacuum pump is turned off, air will enter the system through the vacuum brake valve located between the vacuum pump and the collector chamber. Additional information can be found in the manual or by calling LabConco at 1-800-821-5525.